Okay, so number 78, the one and only Shadow Man. He there he is. <laughs> I don't I don't know much about this game. Um I know it got a sequel on the PS2. Shadow Man 2. But uh yeah. Going into this one pretty blind. What does it say here? Uh developed by Acclaim, published by Acclaim in 1999 for Windows N64, PlayStation, and Dreamcast. And then it got a remaster on PS4, Xbox One, and Switch in 2021. Weird. Super weird. Um, so I guess people like the game. I don't know much about it. Never played it. I never knew anyone that really talked much about it. Give me that high res. Beautiful. Turn up that brightness so I can see. Rever reverse snipe. Is that inverted aim? I don't want that. I'm just going to guess shadow meter on. Please, thank you. Um, Well, I guess let's just get in there. Insert your rumble pack. Thanks, game. Yeah, I know this is like a third person, like action platformer, like was very popular in the time, November, like Legacy of Kain and Tomb Raider and stuff. Moonlight Sonata? That's some super compressed vocals. I took them all to my heart. They Mary made them fit. Chapman, Even if the game audio needs to go up any. I truly love them all, but the immortal power I sought within the sordid confines of their bodies, the still beating organ of the soul, was not. Oof, that is super compressed. The knife was to no avail. I am bereft, and must therefore perform that bloody ritual upon myself. Stay your hand, Jack, and listen to what I have to say. How did you find this place? Who are you? My name is Legion. I for we are many, see the immortal Jack power the that you seek does exist. It does indeed lie within the soul, but only within certain ones, certain dark souls. My God, Duh. what are you that you can? <laughs> My God, dark souls. Merely an explorer, much like yourself. I mean, hey, this what voice is acting is impressive for N64. You are an by trade, are you not? I am. Then I would have you build up a It doesn't look to pain, terrible. A place where you and I and others like it does kind of give off a PS1 together, vibe more than N64. For all of the unique and misunderstood individuals that will follow you as the time of Armageddon approaches, and at the heart of asylum, we shall construct a great dark engine powered by souls of equal hue. The dark we engine of dark souls. Power to create an immortal army to punish and cleanse this pathetic world. And where might I build this cathedral of yours? Across the veil, in the darkness. Amongst the restless spirits of those who are the giant rib cage in the place known as Dead Side. Then, if I am to join you, I must die. It is prophecy. We cannot fail, for we are many. For we His face are is many. a little funky. Okay. A very bloodless that. death. Was this Ray a teen or M? Gotta just be teen, right? That's no, rated M. That was way less violent than I would expect. Oh man, these models. Hmm. What? What's the problem, Magneta? I had a dream, Shadowman. A real bad dream. That was a, a dead quick cut. Dream. The five are here. The heralds of the apocalypse. Beacon's fire confirms everything I feared. The end's common, Shadowman. An ancient prophecy tells of the return of a great evil to Deadside. 
a terrible force gathering dark souls to its dark heart. It's a lot of exposition on an N64 using their game. power to cross over into this world and bring about apocalypse. I must stop this evil from bringing about the end of all things. Only you can do it, Shadow Man. That's a powerful you voice. Walk between the world. I can't go dead, Sykes. And Jaunty's next to useless in both worlds. You are the only one who can do anything about this. As it ever was. But you ain't never confronted anything like this evil. It's so pure, not even the ancient protectors of the Dark Souls could destroy it. They could only banish it from dead sight. They knew it'd come back one day. Hence the prophecy telling of its return. The power of the ancients is all but okay. gone now. And the Dark Souls that evil desires lie unprotected. What you gotta do, Shadow Man, is to go dead sight and recover the Dark Souls. You gotta to collect the Dark Souls. Before evil gathers them to its terrible heart. Okay, so let me get this straight. If I don't <laughs> recover these dark souls, then the world's gonna end. Am I right? You got it. Shit. Look, I gotta go. I've got a lot to do. Take Deacon's file and meet me at dawn at the church on the hill. I've kept your... This really... You. I haven't even played it yet, but this really doesn't feel like in 64. Interesting that this was put on the platform I mean, it came out on everything at the time i guess just a pawn in Nettie's master plan every time there's a swear in an n64 game it catches me off guard time she really does move me can't do nothing about it since nice as you please she knitted my ribs into the mask of shadows i got nothing left anyways my fault loops dead and mom and pop too i deserve everything i get every bad thing that comes my way can't live, can't die. Dead side's the perfect good for me. A nowhere place. The asshole of the universe. Just nice compressed swear words. <laughs> All right, and we're in. Oof. These textures are... I don't know what that is. A little rough. It's a little muddy. Okay. We can strafe. We can jump. Big jumps. We can crouch. We can first person. We can inventory. Kado. And that's it. Assume that's our weird health meter. Oh, this is janky. There's a lot of no sound. Hello? What's that weird walk animation? Okay. Bird. Can I can I grab? No. This is weird. Is it supposed to be this silent? Or is this just the N sixty four version? Okay. All right. Cool. Because I wouldn't be surprised if it's just like on the cartridge, it can't handle all this plus music. Nice, nice tree. Hey, Wilkes, welcome to Shadow Man. What's up? Because I don't know. I'm trying to figure this out. Oh, I don't think I'm supposed to do that. Okay, we can climb very quietly.
I'm just going forward. It seems pretty linear. What? What are my Shadow Man powers? I don't, I don't know what to think of this game. Okay. I hear a heartbeat, and it's gone now. Collecting Kado. It controls kinda stiff, and it looks kinda muddy and ugly. It's got a lot of voice acting, at least at the beginning, which is cool. Is that more dog? That is a dog, indeed. Why are there so many dogs in the cemetery? What? I'm so confused. Can I climb? No. Yeah, it's up, please. Welcome, welcome. But I'm gonna need... Oh no, I can open door. I was going to say, I'm going to need mini brains to figure this out. Me? Hey there, Mike. Glad you could make it. How could I refuse your offer? How could I ever refuse you, Agneta? You can't. I'm simply That's a very irresistible. powerful voice. I, I hope like you it. read the file I gave you and read it real well. Between the lines, you'll find the signs. You got my stuff? Come on in. These are some N64 you know, models trying to do here, detail. I thinking about these dark souls. If they're so damn dangerous, why didn't the ancients just destroy them? Because that's impossible. Their power is their immortality. If evil ever manages to implant these immortal souls into its monstrous slaves, can you imagine the carnage an immortal, unbeatable army would bring to the earth? That's Apocalypse Shadowman. That's the end. Okay, okay. So I, really I am Shadow the Man. Souls before the bad guy. I understand that, but where do I find them? In Gobi. Each Gobi has been sealed by the most powerful voodoo. Not even the greatest okay. Bokor or Mambo can open them to release the dark soul within. Believe me, I've tried. Those things? I've seen a couple of those. Man, or something even more powerful just might be able to do it. Release Is that what those heartbeats I heard were? Take it into yourself. Am I collected them like Mario stars? Souls are pure and ancient evil, and possess a power that should not be abused. Okay, okay. Let's just get this thing over with. You got my stuff? Right here. Jesus, Luke, he's alive. Is that gun scream? Alive and in pain. I've got to help him. He is dead, Mike. You know that. I know, but I saw. It's understandable that you still have strong feelings for your brother. That's why the bear works for you. Connecting you bear. to That's side. a bear? Use like a teddy bear? Mike, go dead side and find Jonty. He's waiting for you at the I'm really curious as to how this looks on like shoulder. Dreamcast or okay. PC. And Mike? Yeah? Because it probably looks a lot better, right? Now, go see Jonty and get them dark souls. Or like this got remastered on, you can play it on like Switch. I'm curious. So I have gun now? I sure do. The gun is not strong enough. Oh, I can push. I don't know why I'm collecting these, but I'm collecting them. Invert wait. No, it's not inverted. My brain was inverted. Mike, there's no time to waste. Use Luke's bear and go dead side. 
Spook's teddy bear? How do I use it? Bayou, Louisiana? Dead side. Okay. Okay. Kind of psychonauts. This game's weird. I am the Lord of Dead Side, shadow born at the confluence of worlds to walk between. Life side is without I feel like that my partly living possesses. I was supposed to read like where the a comic before I played this. At the edges of reason. As a god, this isn't like based on a comic or something, right? The writhing, separating surface of it's the based on the Shatterman comic book. Okay. It's like this this here, feels like a comic what book. Dreams there are in the unctuous coilings of the snake's mortal shuffling. Shatterman is considered hand, a 3D Metroidvania? The arcing what? death blow at the end of all things. The horror, the horror. I embrace it. Okay. I I didn't realize that's what we were getting into. Oh my gun is magic now. And I lost my shirt. I've become true shadow man. What? What is this? That's horrible. Is there any reason to kill these guys? It's also kind of loud. Let's turn that down just a smidge. That's a little better. Yeah, it, it is loud. It wasn't loud until I started actually shooting stuff. That's a lot better. Yeah, for loud for a shadow man. You're pretty loud for a shadow man. Michael, over here. Yes. Hey, was that treating you? Jaunty, kindly refer to me as Shadow Man. <laughs> Michael the One has no place here in Dead Side. Whatever, Mick, it's good to see you again. Seems like simply ages since I last set the eyes on your happy, smiling mug. The feeling's mutual. I suppose you've been away dallying with the old battle axe, giving our woman some of that righteous voodoo so she can stay forever young? Something like that. She's been filling your head with her fated pillow talk again, I bet. Soon say in an army, giddy until you're drunk with the stuff. She did happen to mention a certain prophetic dream she's been having. Did she now? Well, for once I think like, the hour again, the, right. See, the dialogue's very compressed younger? to fit on the oh, cartridge, you can tell. Well, but it's still impressive. There's a lot of it. He was just telling me the other day that he thought it looked remarkably like a picture he once did. Is that Peter Bragel? No, shame it. It's this is Irish cousin. Anyway, he was quite shocked, though he was, at that terrible mess that bloody thing's making. Appeared now that nowhere in turn its way through the place like there's no tomorrow. Which, given what Letty's saying, might not be too far from the truth. Any idea what's going on in there? Nope, and I shan't be knocking on the front door to find out, neither. All I'd say is, if there's something wicked heading this way, it'll be coming from in there. Letty mentioned the Dark Souls. Can you tell me any more about them? I'm afraid I'll have to reply in the negative again, Michael. Suffice it to say, Nettie's told me that they're bloody powerful, well nigh indestructible, and shouldn't fall into the wrong hands. Any idea where they might be? What am I, a Dark Souls travel guide now? I suppose you could try all of the ancient sacred places down amongst the whalers and shiverers. We just hope that none of them souls have ended up in that filthy big black tower. From what Nettie was saying, some of them already have, which is all the more reason for me to be pushing on. Open the gates, Johnny. Places to go, people to say, eh, Michael? Just open the gates, Johnny. Did I ever tell you about the time me and Attila the Hun were playing skittles with the guillotine heads of the French aristocracy? Johnny. All right, all right, keep your bloody hair on. 
which, looking at your shining bonds, may prove to be rather difficult. Open, Anthony. And if cool. you want the proper way to go, I'll still be here. It's just a shame we can't share a drop of the hard stuff together by a rod and tape fire. I don't drink with snakes. All right. The game's so. We were. So, it's so loud. And also so quiet. What? Is you? Are you sucking my soul? There's either. Like. Like there's either absolutely no sound or it's just blasting oh oh we got some music kind of like charge shot no Yeah, it's a it's a lot. It's a bit excessive. Not a fan of the sound design. Everything kind of blends in together. I mean, the, the ambient music is nice now that we have some. I don't like that. Options controller config save resume zero out of four zero out of one twenty. Spooky. I should have, I literally just looked at save. I literally just looked at save. Are you kidding me? What? Why? Why though? How dare I pause? Yeah. I really wish I had clicked save. <laughs> I was looking at it. I'm like, I don't really need to save right now. All right, well, let's run that back. That sucks. Oh yeah, what does this do? Expansion packs found. Right, we should be able to blow through because we, I, hopefully, we can skip cutscenes. Shadow Man enables high res mode. That's it. <laughs> I really need a technical difficulties emote. It happens so much. It's insane. Oh, I paused the game. Yeah, high res mode. I gotta set this again. Turn the brightness up. This is terrible. Okay, fingers crossed. We can skip cutscenes now games i can't believe it games of this era and even later that wasn't really a big thing so many even like ps2 and gamecube games you can't skip cutscenes okay 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 
We, we can get back through this quick. If we can skip all the cutscenes, this won't be bad. We weren't that deep in actual gameplay-wise. Especially now that I am used to the controls a bit. It's not that bad. Just re-grab these. I don't know what these do, but I'm like, I'd rather take the time to re-grab them now instead of three hours into the game. It's like, you need 80 of these. And I'm like, oh no. I really don't know what to think of this game yet. It's like, it's very of the era, but I feel like it might be one of those things where, oh, I forgot about this dog. Um, might be one of those things where like the N64 version just isn't really good. Which obviously this is gonna be the worst version out of the four if it's like PS1, Dreamcast, PC, and N64. This is the weakest. That's just what it is. Just have animation. And I've thought about that with some games, I guess like this one, if we do finish in 64 and end up going to some other similar console, there might be some overlap to compare with. Why is it? Why is A get off? It's up. There needs to be more music. Why is it so quiet? Please. This is what I've decided to play instead of <laughs> streaming the new Thousand Year Door Paper Mario re-release. I'm playing Shadow Man. I mean, it looks like no one else is playing Shadow Man, really, so. Where else can you go to see Shadow Man? What are you going to do, play it yourself? Again, apparently this is, like, I would assume a, a pretty beloved game of the era, since it got a, it got a remaster, like, a couple years ago. Oh, yeah, I got my gun now. All right, send, let's save, uh, save, plot three, game saved, beautiful. All right, we're already almost caught up. This is perfect. I'm still kind of confused overall. I am the Lord of Deadside. I said, I am Shadow Man. Like, I am Turok. Man, I can't wait to play some Turok. Those games are good. Yeah, there's no reason to fight these guys, right? Fine, I'll take the hit. Shoot him with my spirit Shadow Man gun.
I assume this is the right way to go. Let's see if it freezes again. I might lose my mind if it does. Like, that's bad. Because, like, I'm playing this on actual hardware. Shouldn't be doing that. Oh, yeah, this is where it died, right? Can I just shoot? Are there lives or do you just reset? This game sounds awful. It's not great sound design. That's a thing where it's like, you're playing a game and if the sound design's really good, you can like not think about it. But when it's not good, you can't not, <laughs> you can't avoid it. Everything's either deathly quiet or explosively loud. There's no balancing. Okay. Oh no. I've been sick for two days with a headache and fever. The game is not helping. I'm Michael, sorry. Get your ass over here. Michael, back so soon. Getting a bit too spooky for you, huh? Scared of the jail? All right now. I turned the game down a smidge more. But then the quiet stuff is just unhearable. Yeah, I'm, I'm just slowly lowering the game volume over time. Let's, let's bump it down to here. That's, that's better, at least on my end. It's just constant. The screaming is awful. I get it's supposed to be like all the whales of the damned or whatever, but I don't want to have to deal with that. Okay. Die. Do I have an attack other than gun? No, not at the moment. If I did, I would definitely be using it. That's also why I'm avoiding some of these little enemies to just not fight them. Okay, we got some platforming to do. At least that's not shooting. Okay. Nothing. Can I not? Do I have to put do I have to put my gun away? How do I put my gun away? Do I have to unequip gun? I'll do. Oh, I have like left and right hand. Left hand. Hold on. Crouch, snipe, action, left C, inventory, right C, left hand, 
Right hand is B. Okay, left hand Z, right hand B. So if I save my game, fear of dying. So I can put gun in that hand too. Interesting. That's that's kind of neat if I get multiple things like that. So I have to unequip gun so that I can do this. That seems excessive. I don't feel like I should have to do all that. Then I got to re-equip gun. Oh my god. Okay, that works. Blast them. Wait, did I just loop for nothing? Did I, did I loop for nothing? Yeah, this is this is kind of rough. I'm I'm not really enjoying the gameplay loop so far. Yeah, so I did my my thing across that, which it seems like you can just jump up here and climb anyway, and then jump across. I hit the wrong button. I wish I had a little thing to, like, point me where to go. Unless this is just the wrong way? Did I miss something back here? Why is this like this? I stepped in fire. I feel like they should just take less shots. That's also as fast as you can shoot. I am mashing. Let's see. Okay. I might... I might pull up a guide. To help expedite this. Because I... I'm lost. Excuse me? I don't know what that was. Please be quiet. Cease. Oh, I'm burning alive. Thing I can do? Can I open this? No. Looking at a at screenshots of like another version of this game that's not N64, it looks a lot nicer. Um, okay. Ignore the drums, but take a left turn. Is this these are the drums? They look like drums. The way I was going. Near the tunnel's exit, follow the pathway going left. Thanks, Steam. Steam forums. Whoop. Upon exiting from the pathway, you enter another open area. It leads in two directions. One leads across a broken bridge into a tunnel. Uh, 
follow the other path leads to a decorated floor section. Follow the path to the decorated floor. about shatter man this is the decorated floor section like a metroidvania it's i've seen things in this walkthrough that's like come back to this marking on the floor later and you can use this item to open it go up in there? I'm so confused. Uh, okay. One path leads across a broken bridge into a tunnel, which leads to a cave with an optional secret. That would be broken bridge into a tunnel. I have a sneeze coming on. Excuse me. All right. Across a broken bridge into a tunnel. Ignore it. Follow the other path. It leads to a decorated floor. Follow that path to the decorated floor. Dear Lord. From the decorated floor, move onward by staying to the right and go through a narrow pathway. What? This? That just goes in. That doesn't seem right, though. Follow the path until you arrive at a bonfire. Is this? At the bonfire, there's a cable that spans across a spacious zone. Go to the cable. Is it talking about the area, other area I was in? I am very lost. So I remember the cable over here. I'm also close to death and would love to not die. Seems awful. I've shot him so much. I don't know what else to do. Did I, did I not get that health? That seems lame. Is this, is this it? 
Oh, oh. Wait. Did I loop around? Those are the drums. I hope I get a different weapon. Oh, you know what I could probably do? I don't know why I didn't think of this sooner. Sound effects. Let's put those down to like 60. Oh, that's so much better. There, I can turn the whole game up now. Oh, that's so much better. Um, I don't know what to do with this. Forgot about the action button. Because you have left hand, right hand, and action. Oh, that puts your gun away too. Okay, so you don't have to like actually unequip. Got you. Looks like someone left me a note. The sound effects also turn down the voices. That I don't want that. I just want the gun to be quieter. The prophecy. 23rd of November, 19, or 1888. Although centuries may have passed since the time you've read the note, read this note, know that I greet you both as a friend and a brother. Uh, born the burden, the mask of shadows. Know then that I constructed these passageways, the path of shadows as passages through the place known as Dead Side. The, for others that bear the mask, bring order to the realm. I've gathered and cataloged many ancient artifacts of power, However, I fear that I must leave my work incomplete. Seed of darkness has come to this realm. The task of securing the passages has been an immense labor. I fear that with my weakening powers, these outer gates have not been secured as strongly as those deeper within the paths. Okay. Cool. Progress. Save. I feel like I'm back on track now. Okay. Not quite, I guess. The power of the Dark Souls. I embrace it. Okay, so we got a Dark Soul. Is that what we need to open the doors? Okay, it's hot. Oh, I see. It shows I need one Dark Soul. Yeah, it's a shame that turning down the sound effects turns down all the voices. But I need that gun to be quiet. Man, that one has two filled in.
Yeah, this combat isn't very good. I, I don't know if I'm missing something. I don't think I am. Okay. Unsalvaged souls that drift beyond the narrow gates for an eternity of waiting. This infinite limbo, this wasteland, this untamed, unnatural afterbirth I command with my endless darkness. What ineffable secrets are whispered within the paths of shadow? What red edge realities rising bleak above the blasted skyline? Deadwing, duppy, zombie mother. This voodoo Duppy? lord outlast them all. Okay. Is this just the game? Just go through. Shoot. We have like ammo types, like shotgun shells and stuff that uh, sh that show up, like inventory. But I I don't know. That's where I came from. Let's check the left. Oh, okay. There's like weird swimming. Oh, this is weird swimming. Is there oxygen? No? Shadow Swim Man. Why does he swim like that? It's so awkward. How do I jump out of the water? Okay. Button. Button. Okay. Oh, okay. I don't know. So that, that shot a thing across to there. I don't know what I just acquired. Like everything's just so muddy. So muddy looking. The combat's not very good. The sound mixing is pretty abysmal. I'm being eaten by fish! The Shadow Man weak to fish. Just in. Like, it's, it's very of the era. It just doesn't feel very good. And I I feel like it might be unfortunately that the N64 version might just be bad. That is very possible. What do I do from here? Okay. That got me, like, nothing. Shoot the fish. Okay. 
Okay. I don't like the way this game controls that much. The fact that the enemies take so many hits and they don't like get stunned means like this is the best way to fight them. Just sit in the water and scum it out. Like, I can see that like, maybe it's better once I get more items and weapons. But it's pretty rough for the time being. I don't know what this is. Can I use this? Is this a button? Video games. Beautiful. Are there bosses in Shadow Man? I feel like I should be able to lock on, like Z target Zelda style. Oh, hey, one of these things. Dark Soul. I'm going to save again because I'm a feared of progress being lost. Oh, yeah, there you go. Wasteland Temple of Life. Zero of 13 is one of 120. I am collecting them like Mario. Uh... Ooh. Mario stars. What happens if I load? Will it put me back exactly where I was? Or do you always restart the stage? We got to figure that out now. No, you always restart stage. Okay, let's, well, let's see if progress gets saved. Hey, do you mind, sir? Um, if the gate is still open, then that's not bad. Oh, yeah, the, the dart is still shot across. Some weird bat. Okay, yeah, this isn't that bad, then. Okay, don't jump in the lava. Lesson learned. That, that that will just kill you. Just back up and shoot. Wow, this seems kind of terrible. Yeah, he jumps back really fast, but he only walks slowly. health so fast. I'm curious. I'm going to have to pull up because I am curious. Um, oh, no. What the, like, reviews were like 
like, did the other versions review good, but N64 review bad? Because even for the time, this doesn't seem great. Ooh, oh, I'm stuck. Quite a step down from Tonic Trouble. What are the are these currency? What are we what are we doing? Platforming is a little janky. A little janky to say the least. It's one of those games where it controls best. It controls its best while you're moving. When you stop and try to make small motions, not great. But if you just keep on running, it's, it's all right. It's, it's all right. I don't know if I want to go that way. like a big maze. The hell am I? There's like no enemies, which is good because I don't really want to fight them. But it, it just feels so like vacant. You know? Is this the way I came from? Or is this a different way? Alright. Oh, this one. Like, it's kind of cool looping back and be like, Ah, oh, this thing I saw earlier. Here we go. That's two. Do I need 70 to beat the game? That's my assumption. This is not the way. This way. You know, I was I was toying in my head where I'm like, all right, I kind of want to do Shadow Man because we've been putting it off for so long. But I was like, I, I could go for a nice relaxing night. I might do... Harvest Moon, and of course, as you can see, I, I settled on Shadow Man. I don't think that was the best choice. It's fine. We have Harvest Moon for some other time. Here we go. Yeah, so am I actually just... Truthfully, didn't know if I'd ever play Shadow Man. I was really putting it off. I, I kind of want to look back and see how long ago did we actually roll Shadow Man on the wheel. But yeah, it's just literally, I'm just going to go through, do platforming and such until I find enough Dark Souls to beat game. Yeah, it's definitely been a long time. Well, I can see. It's the oldest thing that we've pulled and not played. Whoop. But I'm kind of glad I waited and didn't do this like too early on. 
I don't know. I don't know why. Just a feeling I'm getting from it. Oh yeah, I meant to look up review-wise. Now I got like 70s across the board, except for the PlayStation version was bad? Weird. Weird, weird. Shadow man. Oh, hello. Does everyone just shoot green goo here? That's your lot in life? You know, I don't think I could have taken it if I didn't realize I could go into settings and turn down the gun sound. Okay, there's a thing up there. Shadow man. I guess I have to get up there and get that. That's glowing like a power up. This is where I came from. I'm. This is very easy to get flip turned upside down. This is where I came from. Like everything is the same muddy brown texture. I don't know if putting my gun away actually helps anything. And I can't tell if him moving his head around is just an idle animation or him like looking at items. This is a jump. He can, he can, Shadow Man can jump. He's got that going for him. Oof, but he sure can't have a good camera. I don't know about this. Do I have to like let go of A? What is Oof. Oh, oh. Okay. Again, the textures make it hard to see. It's so quiet. Then do I jump back? Okay. That's probably what I have to do. But I got to figure out how that works. So while I'm hanging on, A jumps back. Got you. You have to like, re you have to hit A to ready up. And then hit A again to jump. Did the music, like, time out? Because it was playing music, wasn't it? And it just, it just, it just stopped. Like, it didn't loop. It was like, alright, you've taken long enough. Wrap it up, Shadow Man. Shadow Man. And then, huh. Wow, that's terrible. Um... Tomb Raider, this is not. Give me that. Okay, you get these pretty quick, though. We got four. Oh, I can charge up now that I have more Dark Soul power. Okay, I'm gonna have to try that. See if that's better. Maybe that'll make combat less arduous. Whew, 
I never feel like I'm going to make a jump like that in this game. What does it want me to do? Jump backwards? Okay. You can't, like, move the camera. So I don't know. Okay, this already feels a little better with charge shots. Though I don't feel like they're doing any more damage. Beautiful. What gameplay. Okay, I got something. A, a song? Uh, okay. What does that do? Okay, I have new attack. I have fire attack now. That's kind of cool. Does he not care about the fire? Okay, no, it does damage. I can attack faster now, at least, because I can alternate. That's cool. Oh, this thing takes one, two, three, four, five, six. I only have two. It is kind of fun how it all loops around. Like, the level design's kind of nice in that way. It's just hard to tell where you are. Not what I wanted. Ooh, ooh. The fish is going to kill me. Can you climb out? Do I need to unequip my weapons to climb out of the water? I think I do. This thing is freaking out. Entirely freaking out. I don't know if I can do anything about it. Oh, am I out of the ability to cast this? I guess I am. Okay, I see. Interesting. What a, what a video game. This game. get stuck on the walls. Oh, 
Let's see. Is that a thing I can do? Can I just walk up that? God, look at him just stuck. He's going to fling off the ledge. Yes, hello. Down there. This is a lot. I see this guy here. die. It seems like there's not fall damage, which is kind of nice. Yeah, they can die pretty quick now. The combat is, I mean, it's about the same, but it feels a lot better since enemies are dying faster. I'm not just mashing gun forever. Fire indeed hot. Okay, so that's back there. Thanks. I, I still can't get over how the lack of music. Just the silence you're left with. Okay, where's that? Rope. It's connected up there. Because I can jump across. Oh my god. This this game's getting to me. We'll we'll be due for something fresh for sure. At least most of the, like, really just completely bad games aren't that long. You know, most of the stuff we've played that's been bad has been really short, too. Besides, like, Superman. Even some of the games that could be good, the length can be daunting. The Dark Souls. I am Shadow Man.
that noise is terrible. Okay, a little bit of health. Yeah, much more manageable. Okay, music's back. Music suddenly decided to return. The band woke up. The music's like not bad either. It's just, it just goes away sometimes. need the various suit. It's too much lava. Yeah, it's too hot. I guess I can't go that way yet. Yeah, Shadow Man, weak to heat, weak to fish. A lot of weaknesses we're learning about. You know, think of weaknesses. It's a shame there's not more Pokemon games to play on this system. I think all we have left is Pokemon Snap and Hey You Pikachu. The, the one very good and one not so good. Not really a regular Pokemon game to play. What is that? Does it have face? Can't stand heat. Same. I'll I'll take cold over heat any day of the week. Any day of the year. Much prefer cold. Heat is just, it's exhausting mentally and physically. I'm just not here for it. It's too much. What? What? Huh? Can I not do whatever this is? time you walked your dog today got exhausted it was hot today i wasn't even outside but it was just hot in my work it's awful the heat sucks <laughs> these goofy spikes you used to have to walk um, when I was younger, my mom had a black Dotson, and he was completely black and so low to the ground being a Dotson that he just like couldn't walk on like sidewalk or asphalt during the summer. It would just absolutely take him out. And I felt so bad for the little guy. I was like, that's just his lot in life. A poor little guy. It was a, yeah, it was a lot of me carrying, <laughs> carry the dog to the grass 
let him do his business, and then carry him back home. She was completely pampered and spoiled in every other aspect of life. Not that he deserved to deal with that. That's just unfortunate. Are you kidding me? Okay, Ooh, that's a decent checkpoint. That's not terrible. Um, but yeah, he was fine. Yeah, I've been looking at... I always check the weather, and I've just been looking at those numbers go up and up this week. I'm not having it. Like, I get happy when I see it's going to rain, because at least it's going to feel a little cooler. Plus, I just like rain in general. Regardless of hot or cold, rain is always nice. Relaxing. Okay, I'm starting to understand this game more. What it what it wants from me. Oh my god, this is going to be rough! Oh no. These instant... At least it's not like reload your save or back to the title or anything. Oh, but we're going to be having some instant deaths. This game is feeling better. There's like actual platforming and I can see what I'm supposed to do instead of it all being muddy brown textures in the mountains. I did start rewatching for like the third time uh twin peaks this week is what i ended up going on so i've seen it a couple times before uh but ash had never seen it and i always like showing shows like that to people who haven't experienced them before and that show holds up it's been probably almost 10 years since i last watched it this classic TV. Turn. Whew. I'm just gonna scream. I'm gonna lose my mind. This is that Indiana Jones lava level all over again. Heard heard of it and good things. Truthfully, I have no idea what it's about. I would uh, highly recommend watching it if you can. Pretty much all of it's on Paramount, except for the movie, which is on HBO's streaming for whatever reason. Um, but it's it's a murder mystery that's just not always specifically about that. It's weird. It's very bizarre. It's very David Lynch. If you watched anything else David Lynch has done. I still don't know what it's about after watching the first episode. Yeah, it's weird. 
murder the murder mystery up in the Pacific Northwest, and it's just kind of weird and unhinged. But I think it really holds up for a show that's like 30 something years old. I'm excited to watch the rest of it again. It's definitely one of my favorite TV shows, but it's not the kind of TV show you can put on anytime, you know? It's a little too much for that. It's not like a, a Futurama or something that you can just kind of mindlessly enjoy. Is it like X-Files? I would say if you like X-Files, you'll like, um, oh my God. If you like X-Files, you'd like Twin Peaks. It always looks spooky. It's like spook adjacent. I'd say it's spook adjacent. It's not actively trying to, like, spook you, you know? But it can be a little, like, weird and unnerving at times. But also, it can be goofy and funny at times. It's a weird... It's a weird one. And it can be kind of hard to get into because of that. And also because the first episode is the length of a feature film. It's an hour and a half long. I can't believe I finally made this jump. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Okay. Progress is being made. I'm starting to get into the groove of this game. And maybe it's if I think about it less and talk about something else like Twin Peaks. I just start to like go, you know? And I'm digging it now that it's actively, consistently playing music. It definitely makes it a lot more enjoyable. Oh god. You know, I said that and the music stopped. It's just dead silent again. Why? Baton. Okay, what what does baton do? A song, baton. Baton. Oh, okay. Cool. Oh, it's a warp. That's cool, I guess. Is this where I came from? And the music's back again. It seems so weirdly inconsistent when it decides to play music or not.
39 Cadeau. 40. Given in offering to the lower, shall greatly increase the strength of a man's spirit. Are they their upgrades? Damn, I obviously don't have enough Caddo. One hundred are required to make an offering to the lower. Okay, so I need a hundred Caddo to upgrade, like extra health, maybe. Do I have to come back here whenever I want to cash in? Okay, well, we have the baton now. That's kind of cool. Cadeau. Um, can I use the teddy bear? Oh, okay. Bayou, Louisiana, zero out of eight, one out of four. Oh, okay, so there's 120 Dark Souls in general, and I can see four, four, 13. Okay. On, and I can use this to like fast travel around? Do you fast travel at any time? That's kind of nice. Is this game actually getting kind of better now that we have things to do? It's just the opening bit is not. That's a shame. Like, I'm kind of glad I stuck with it now. Still seems kind of easy to get lost, which, again, if this is compared to like a Metroidvania, which I could kind of see, um, that makes sense. Part of it's like exploring around. Oh, yeah, I can open this now, can't I? Do enemies stay dead when you kill them? There were enemies here before. I can open this level two gate. Cool. I'm the Lord of Dead Side. We'll sidestep. I don't know. Have we had any other games that gave like rough first impressions but ended up better I think we've had the inverse it's still kind of ugly this one's three yes yeah, so I don't have enough for this yeah Indy was also the inverse How was that fair? <laughs> okay, at least deaths don't really matter. Because that was... Oh my god, I gotta climb all the way back. That was some bullshit. Yeah, Indy was inverse, where it started really good, but it just fell apart by the end. Um, Superman got worse as it went on. Most games that are bad are just upfront bad. That's right, there are games like this where it's like, it's rough until you really get into the swing of it and things start rolling. And I can see what this game wants to be now more than what it was at the beginning where it was just really confusing. Where are you going? That's a dead end. <laughs> it's, it's a loading screen. Roaring to 
eternity, ravaging the already benighted landscape with its savage, malevolent presence. And within the regions of the truly damned, insanity, sheer and stark, and once in human form, now gutted and torn by eons of glutted indulgence. Their bloodlust flecking the oily walls, living in the shrieks of victims ensnared, hanged, drawn, and quartered by the serpent's squalid writhings. This is the place I have not wanted to dream of, and the dream is now the place I partly lived through. Damn, that's intense. <laughs> they got his voice and like, we're gonna have you do some monologues, dude. Light on enemies. What is this? Can I do anything with this? No. Oh, I gotta put my weapons away. Whoop. We're back to the silence. Frames. Let's save. It's been a minute. This also takes a ton of space. I need to get more memory cards. Whoop! Searchlights? What? Interesting. Lava. Oh, he's got barrels to shoot. That's fine. I'll take the hits. I guess I can have my weapons put away most of the time. What do you what do you want me to do about these? Ow. Because the lava will instantly kill me. I no hot hands dead dead from hot hands beautiful great all right let's run that back What does it want from me? 
Also, fire hurts a lot. Fire hurts a lot. Can I go this way? see a dark soul over there. God, I'm waiting for the time I die to that. Please. Okay. Um uh, hmm. Do you come closer or are you just moving up and down? You're just moving up and down. Can I make that jump? Oh, hold on. Here we go. Or not. <laughs> it's just a little janky. Just a little bit of jank. We'll wait our turn. I'm sorry. Whoop. You know, playing games like this... Again, not that it's, like, actively bad. I should have jumped off. But it makes it all the more impressive when you look at other games that came out in this era that just did, like, insane stuff that revolutionized what games became. Like, on the N64 stuff, like Ocarina of Time, or, like, look at PS1 with, like, Metal Gear Solid and stuff like that. Some of them truly were ahead of the curve. Whoa! Okay, we got more of these moving platforms. Loving all the insta-deaths still remaining. I can't believe I lived that. That's terrible. God damn. Oh, I'm back here. You know, at least it's quick to reload, even if you do have to go back through a bit. Dude. I was trying to be easy so I wouldn't overshoot. My god, Shadow Man. Get it together. I feel like this game is going to be one of the ones that wears out my thumb. That N64 analog stick. I mean, they learned from their mistakes, and they made the, the GameCube one soft rubber. There was a new concept for them. I wish I could use the D-pad. Like, the N64 controller has a nice big D-pad. I do love when you get to use it. Stuff like Kirby 64, it's great. Yeah. 
I do have, I forget where it is, I do have like a third party N64 controller that's essentially a GameCube style controller that does have that soft rubber stick on it. And that's pretty nice. But we're just using the like plain old N64 for now. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Stop and time it. Okay. Heal me up. Whoa, what the hell are you? You're new. You make pig noises. Not a fan of that. I mean, I guess I could see where the M rating comes from in some cases. It's not too terribly violent. The environments are just kind of bloody. All the enemies are kind of the same. They just kind of run at you. And you just back up and shoot. Hello! Spooky. Yeah, and I guess I'll be able to charge up even bigger shots the more Dark Souls I collect, which is kind of nice. Oh, hello. Speaking of, just out in the open for me. There's one up here, too. If I can get up there. Not from here, I don't think. Locked. Whoa, 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 whoa. Back it up. Oh my god, you guys hurt so much! That doesn't seem very fair. Why does it hurt so much? Like, and there's no, like, you get no iframe, so you just constantly take damage if they get near you. 
from from where Oh, does this lock on? Oh, that would have been helpful. Okay. R is a lock on. Good to know. I thought it was just strafe button. But it is a full, like, lock on. Ooh. Nice. <laughs> Movement. go here. Better energy. Engineer's key. What was that? What does that mean? I can equip it. Is it a weapon? No. Tis not. Oh. But I can punch it in there. Okay. So I can open doors now. And what have you. That's cool. Gun. Get rid of him. No, thank you. It's kind of cool how they do explode. From your shadow gun. Okay, I'm back here. We'll say this feels very different than anything else on the system. At least out of what we've played so far. We've played a decent amount, don't won't you kill me. Take that. The power of the dark souls. I the dark souls. Oh, sir. Can you not shoot me? What does it remind me of? Strafing and running back and forth. Like a monorail? A train?
definitely not what I want. Oh, the frames. Hello, sir. I didn't expect dudes to just have, like, regular guns, but I guess I'm holding a gun. So that's that. My key. Oh, that's the front entrance. I'm back out here. Cool. So I can come and go as I please now. That's pretty nice. Oh, I got three charged now. I see one up there too, but I don't think I can get up top yet. It's kind of neat to have like a game like this where you're ex not just exploring to go through the levels, but you're constantly collecting an item to get up to the full 120 by the end of it, or however many you need to beat it. Like your overarching goal, instead of just going like level, level, level. It's cool. I appreciate that. God, I've been playing longer than I thought. I feel like this game really picked up because I saw we were like an hour in and I felt like nothing had happened. And now we're two hours in and I'm like, all that happened in the last hour? Like we're moving along now. Is it a, a casket train? How many do we have now? Eight. Get this gun ready. Oh yeah, they're coming at me. It's almost like a little, little Metroid Prime side hops. I'm just, just way clunkier. Do I? Hello. Was that a lion cub? I couldn't tell. This looks cool. There's a lot of dudes. You know, I've been having lack of, I, what's the word? I've been drawing a blank when it comes to food lately, as far as like cooking dinner. I need something exciting 
to cook. Get me back into it. I need some fun recipes. I've been very much slacking on actually cooking dinner and just like eating out or whatnot or making like very simple dinners. But nothing's super hit me. What did that do? Hello? Wait, did I switch my gun hand? How did I do that? But yeah, I need I need some good good ideas. Good dinner foods. Hello. Okay, you're nothing, I guess. It's just empty, silent room. this. Did I? Did it open that? I don't know. I guess I can't do that here. I suppose. Oh, I see there's like multiple. Okay. Huh. Yeah, that's where we got off the train. What's in here? Got excited a few weeks ago we cooked rice with turmeric and rice got all yellow. The, like, adding just something to rice to spice it up. I haven't done turmeric. I've done it before, but it's been a long time since I've done anything like with that. But, like, just being like, I'm just going to, like, grate ginger and put it in my rice. And it adds so much. Like, if I'm just making, like, chicken and, like, like, sweet and spicy chicken. And just gonna do some rice. Just add ginger on top of plain white rice. Can I make this jump? I'm gonna assume I can. Whoop! Hell yeah. I should make tonkatsu. I haven't made tonkatsu in forever, and I used to make it all the time because I love it. And it's really not that hard to make once you're comfortable with frying. I know frying isn't the healthiest thing, but it tastes good. Can't help if I love a tempura mushroom. This is a bunch of nothing. Am I missing a door or something? Hmm. Stuck. What am I missing? I'm back to being lost again. I 
I don't remember going down all these stairs. Yeah, this was back in the main room. Okay. Okay. Let's look back in here. If I go straight ahead, oh, it opens. Okay. Oh, jeez. I might die. Don't kill me, please. Let me get this health. Jesus kicked me to death. Lame. Okay, at least we checkpoint right here. Yeah, and they do stay dead. Interesting. Dying doesn't really mean anything. At least while you're in the area, if you kill an enemy, they stay dead. You got anything going on? No? Just having a hard time? the way to go. Save. Got nine. So this game wasn't supposed to take that long. It was like under 10 hours. Cathedral of Pain, Gateway. So, Asylum, we went from the Dead Side Marrow Gates, Path of Shadow, Prof Pass of Shadow, Prophecy Chamber, Wasteland, Temple of Life, Asylum Gateway, and Asylum Cathedral of Pain. I didn't mean to use it, but that's fine. It should put me exactly where I am. puts me right here can the can the train take me anywhere else like if I pull this does it just take me back to asylum This is back here, and the enemies do respawn. Understood. Huh. 
Huh. I think I need to be back here. It's gonna respawn everyone though. Yeah. Don't. It's lame that they're back. Is this just death if I walk down there? I think so. Asylum Cathedral of Pain. That's not where I want to be, though. How do I go elsewhere? The little guide I had said there was, like, multiple... Go on the side the train. Inside the carriage, activate the handle that shows the description 2 to drive to the next train region. Which is supposed to be the experiment rooms. But I just see one handle. I, I don't know how to take this elsewhere. It says you can drive this to three places. The asylum, the cathedral, and the experimentation rooms. And it wants me to go to the experiment rooms. I don't know how. I'm not supposed to be here yet. Clearly, as I cannot do anything here. Curious. There is a floor down there. There is that. Hmm. Hello. You are already all the way out here? What are you doing? Ow. Okay, I tried. That's not happening. Let's see here. I got another sneeze. I'm big sneezy today, and I don't know why. It's been all day long. Oof, excuse me. Gosh. The rain has just made me sneezy, I guess. I don't think it's any kind of allergies or anything. Mm -mm. Let's see. Asylum. Let's go. Hmm. I feel like I'm just a generally sneezy person, like overall. Like, I sneeze more than the average human. Yeah, I got the thing there. Huh. Use these. Just health. Energy.
Maybe I do need to leave then. What happens if I just go back to not land of the dead? There was stuff out here for sure I could grab, but I don't know if I can... Can I still use my energy here? I'm just a normal guy with gun. Oh yeah, I'm just a normal guy here. I followed the Dark Souls trail into the asylum, but where the hell are the five? They're in this world, Shadow Man. Five mortal men touched by the power of the Dark Souls. Unlike you, they don't have the mask of shadows controlling and channeling the dark power. It twists their minds, fills their already tainted hearts with even greater perversions, and a hatred so terrible it has sent them insane. Okay, so they're in this world, but where exactly? That's your job, Shadow Man. You gotta go back to the asylum and find a way through. The same way the Dark Souls found their way into the Five. Hunt your mothers down, Shadow Man, and kick their sorry asses. But remember, can do an immortal power, and only by taking their souls will you truly defeat them. Ah, dead side, Mike, and quit buttering me. Okay. Yeah, I can't. I can't bust these ones. It's not. Okay, well, in that case. Hmm. Oh, you know what? I am level three now. I got three pips. So could I go open those level three doors? That's probably what I need to look out for is when I go up a tick. That means I can go open new doors. Oh, there's enemies here now? Or I guess there was before. They've just finally respawned now that I've left long enough. So I got level three. Down here. Yeah, I can open you up now. got some new upgrade will eclipse there la lune uh what do you what, 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 what does that do can i read it can i read what this does is there a way to like see like get info That's how I'd read that. Um, hmm. I don't know what that does. It sure would be nice to know. Hello. It's too stupid to go single file through the door. There's another one down here. That one is also three. I am the Lord of Dead 
side. Yeah, based on name, is it something that clips on command? I, I, if only any button would do anything with it. I'm gonna save though, cause we we got something. Progress being made. The controls are funky, and I think that's them just trying to make it work on a. On an N64 pad, can I just jump down? Will I die? I should be fine. Hello? Oh, tunnel. Again, like, that that blends in so much. As you're just like, where do I go? Oh, this. A little more distinction. Okay, yeah, we're in the next zone. We need four for that one. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. So I guess we'll go here. And then once we get up to four pips, we can come back and open that door. I guess that's that's kind of the loop. Whenever you find enough to gain another pip on your bar, go back to the main zone, unlock new areas. Mario has now enough stars to challenge Bowser. At the dead side margins, in the hushed and shivering tones of the lurking, lurching revenants, these ancient places led temples to Valoa, where the dark souls did find their secret corner, hidden by the sanguinary sisters steeped in voodoo lore. Interesting. Straight up death traps. I'm not going to grab it. Oh, I have my weapons out. Let's see what we got here. It's a lot of paths. I'm going to get so lost. Crazy that there's no, like, map at all. Like, look at this nonsense. This twisting, turning cave. This is back to the start. That's so much. Can't do that yet, whatever that is. I saw some of that earlier in the game, too. I thought it was just decoration, but it's probably something we can do with an item. It's so quiet. <laughs> Except for that. Oh, oh, oh. Fish. Huh. Cool. Temple of Fire. Okay. Toucher. To share.
I feel like this will give us something that we can withstand lava with if we're in the Temple of Fire. And then we can go back to some of those earlier areas and clean up. Ah, yeah, no, I can't do that. that music. Is that a person? I'll just jump down, I guess. Oh no, those are Dark Souls. So I gotta build the steps. Oh. It's back out here. Huh. Let's see. Another door I could have gone through. Ah, yes, I could have. Maybe? No? It's back this way then. Watch me completely loop around. I did a full loop, didn't I? Okay. Oh, but hold on. Button. Button up here. That's one more. That's something. There wasn't like a secret thing down here, right? Try to actually go the other way this time. Okay, that's the one I went through before. Which there is multiple paths. Fire door. Fire itself. I need whatever firepower I get so I can start using those. Oh yeah, I think I came up this way. Hot, hot door.
need more buttons. Okay, that's goes back to the bottom of that zone. Is it just... Let's see. Got my baton. I've got my gun. My shadow man gun. You can shoot it. <clears throat> okay. Okay. The lack of enemies makes it a bit more spooky. I don't feel like I have anything I can do in here at the moment. Yeah, that's too high up. Let's go try one of these other doors. Don't open the door, just break it down. Okay. Oh, I see a thing with Bob. I would like that. No buttons here. that progress double digits we're at 10 there's a button is this one of the ones I need it is two more Oh, are you... Are you evil? You seem... As though you might be. I guess I'll just leave you for now. What? What? You are evil! What the hell are you? What, what are you even supposed to be? I'm going to die. That was ridiculous. They're so much faster. Oh, Jesus. All the way back. That's rough. Well, at least we hit the switch before they killed us, so I don't think I need to go back. Do I have to make my way back to that weird... Was it up? the pool that let me swim to the next zone. I feel like it would have checkpointed me near those waterfalls at least. Yeah. 
swim, Shadow Man. Oh. There we go. And we're back. I think there were still one or two more doors we could break down. Thank God it doesn't, like, take away any progress if you botch it. That would make it a lot rougher. Spikes. Uh, this way. Oh, it's more view. Please don't wake up. I'd love to not deal with you. Feels like a Zelda room. Like straight up Ocarina of Time. It's like that uh, room in the Dongo Cavern. Once I hit the button. Oh, they can fly. Beautiful. Please don't kill me again. Oh, there's multiple. Okay. Still kind of hard to deal with. Let's get out of here. that exit was. I like that when he becomes Shadow Man, he like loses his shirt, but he still just keeps his like, his just normal slacks. His Shadow Man slacks. You know, practical. that last button. Okay, another one of you. This should be the last button. Can I just leave? Like if I if I leave really fast, can I just leave? Oh no. I'm gonna run. They can't chase me forever, surely. Yeah, do they stay in their little room? Beautiful. Fantastic. I think we finished all the steps. I feel my thumb wearing out. Slow. 
me. Whoop. How do I, uh, how do I get through the fire? Do I just run through it? Oh my, you gotta be kidding me. Instant? I just touched the fire and just died. I can't, I can't believe that. Come on. That's so much. That's so punishing. Come on. Oh, did I accidentally go the wrong way? I just reset. No, I hope I didn't reset everything. By accidentally leaving. I just, I just 180 for some reason, just in disbelief. Okay. Surely all the buttons are still pressed and we're good to go. We just gotta get rid of that fire, I guess. Whatever's going on with that. That's the flame door. Every time I come through here. <laughs> they do like no damage. All right, let's climb to the top and take a look. Yeah, these are all, I've already gone through these, right? They just like rebuilt them, I think. I think, yeah, yeah, yeah. They just put the doors back up because I left. They like respawned. Which I definitely didn't mean to. Whoop. That's the one I want to go through. bit more progress tonight. Yes, I already hit this button, right? Yeah, it's hit. The fire's still going on up there, which I don't know what to do about. Maybe there's one more button I need to hit to extinguish flame? Got that one. Six. Once. Yeah, I'm missing one switch. There's probably one door I didn't go through. I would assume. It's my guess. Flame gate. I'm spiraling. I swear I tried to shoot that the first time I went through and nothing happened. Oh yeah, this one. I never figured out anything here. Was there just a button I missed? Oh, there's a button right in the middle. 
if I can get to that. Let's see. Can I make... Oh, can I like... Ah, okay. I see what I missed. It's the power of shadow, man. Slow platforming. I pressed A. I pressed it. God damn you, Shadow Man. I really hope you don't need all 120 souls to beat the game. Can I just walk off? Beautiful. I have passed the first trial. That was the trial to push six buttons. for us. Later. Get me out of here. The fire's finally gone. You're not allowed to damage boost through. zone tonight. Okay, at least it put me right here, just facing the wrong way. Thank God. Okay, I got, got my action roll. That didn't help. Well, it doesn't hurt that much, honestly. That does. Does it face me here? How many times can we fall in lava tonight? Grab the ledge, Shadow Man. Use your arms, your shadow arms. This puts me the wrong way. Oh, I just made the jump this time. Oh. The frame rate. Frames. Ooh. Oh, I see you up there. There's like multiple up there. I would love to get those. This feels like a boss room or something. Do I just, do I just jump down? Dog. The jump is so jank. No, don't make me go through all of that again. You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. 
What do you mean? Yeah, they don't actually knock you around. They just deal damage. I'm gonna, I'm gonna lose it. I'm gonna... Shadow Man. Action roll. What the hell was that? Ways back. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna jump. The frame rate. Ooh, the frames. S saved it. Ow. energy okay Whew. Whew. this is terrifying okay oh no whoop whoop you gotta move so fast in a game where you can't really move fast. Beautiful. A little more health. Okay, we're getting there. Whatever this is, we're getting it. Hey, hey, hey if that's enemies, don't. Don't be. This is terrible. Why I can't hit her. Okay, is she is she done? No. Hey, can you like get closer? I'm gonna side strafe into the damn lava and die again. Lava doesn't hurt her. Unlock. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay. Ah! No, no. Do those two buttons stay pushed, though? That's the question. Can I start going the other way? Because this is too much. The instant death is excessive. Like, it should, like... I don't know. It should restart me in that room, is what it should do. Like, like Zelda, you know? It should just do that. Why put me back at the beginning of the obstacle course? Okay, it looks like it's gone down some, so that probably counted. That's honestly, this game's one saving grace. There's so much instant death, but every little bit of progress does save. Perfect.
It's crazy how much, like, the instant death is annoying, but how much better this game is now that stuff's actually happening. It's just so much more interesting. What? You're getting lasered like those apes in Congo? Oh, we got little laser tattoos. What does that, what does that do for us? I still don't know what this does. Oh, there's a little door over here. Got little flame arms. I accidentally put my, oh, does that let me push these hot blocks? Yeah, it does. Okay. That's my upgrade. There's a lot of those I saw. So There'll be a decent amount of stuff we can go back and push. Oh, God. Why? Yeah, there's some... There's, the hot blocks all the way back, like, towards the beginning of the game we can go back and do. But I feel like I probably will save that. I like to save that until we get a bunch of upgrades so we can go back and just do a bunch at once instead of, like, having to constantly go back to earlier areas every time we get an upgrade. Okay. Oh, hello. Hello up there. Hi, ladies. Go ahead and explode. You take so many hits. It's excessive. Thank you. Oh, yeah, so this will probably let me... There was the um, the thing in the asylum where there was the flaming pillars blocking the path. Now I guess I can, like, cling on to them and go around them if fire doesn't hurt my hands. And only my hands. Yeah, exactly like this thing. Whoop. Barely. Oof, that's, that effect, it kind of kills the frame rate. Cool. Let me get this guy. And then we're just back down here. Um, okay. Cathedral pain. Temple. I thought it said Temple of Time. Temple of Fire. Toucher. Is that that's the ability we got? Hmm. Are we just gonna get more stuff on us as we go through? That's kind of cool. Like seeing the upgrades. Still only got three pips though. So I need to get more. I might have to go back and get more souls. To actually make progress and open the next door.
Let's see. I can't remember where they all were. Honestly. Yeah, because this goes back out to there. I don't want to go here, I don't think. That's going to be the thing, is like, you don't get a map. This is like a Metroidvania, but there's no map. I guess more like just, just straight up Metroid, like not much vaniness to this. It's more just straight up Metroid. Yeah, like original Metroids, except those aren't in 3D. <laughs> So it's a little more like doable. Are mine. Though I will always recommend to play the remakes that have maps <laughs> of those. Nice, nice jump. Okay, we got one more. Let me see here. So that is, can I do this like this? Come on, Huh. Is that what that does? Can I just use that? It says it can let me be Shadow Man in the living world. So can I just do this? No, 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 not at all. Not quite. I need to know. Shadow man. Oh, sir. What does this do? Uh, All three pieces are found. Ah, you need three you need three pieces of it. It's not just one by itself. Okay. Cool. Understood. Well in that case. Uh let's save real quick. Shadow Man. So I definitely need to just find more souls to do anything, which I think if I go to here, I might be able to get some at the temple and then some at the asylum. And that'll give me level four at some point, And I'll be able to go open the fourth door and go to the next new area. And thus the cosmic ballet continues. Because there was definitely some fire stuff in uh in the temple here. All these enemies respawned. Whoop. And then I'll probably wrap up as soon as we get a couple more of these things. Yeah, now that I'm understanding this more, I, I feel like progress is just going to increase in pace. Shadow. Shadow. Shadow about these guys. Uh, 
Uh, let's see. Yeah, I think it was right in here. Shadow man. Yeah, this block. Hopefully there's one behind it. I cannot see anything that's happening on screen, but that's fine. <laughs> it worked. Yeah, there we go. Hey, back off. Still on three. Hey, I still can't walk on lava. Maybe I'll get leg markings that let me walk on lava. Are all of his power-ups fire-based? But no, after, like, getting into this and being, like, a little ways into it, I, I see why this was popular at the time why people liked it and why it got the the remaster on switch and pc that you can play now especially considering again this is probably the the worst version of the game probably the ugliest and worst it plays on any system and it's still like it's pretty good definitely definitely got its issues but overall pretty good I'm interested to see, not that we're playing it because it's not on N64, but there is a sequel to this on PlayStation 2. And the sequel's like only on PS2, I think, which is interesting considering Shadow Man 1 was on everything. Try to die again, even though I've gone through this area so many times now. You just fall into the lava, that would be lovely. Right, I think there was a hot block over here. Ow. Beautiful. I stubbed my toe and fell into lava. Where does that put me? Okay, that's not terrible. Try this again. Jump, turn. I'm gonna lose it. This is the exact same. There were a lot of games kinda like this and how they played in this era. That I have some fondness for. I do like the Legacy of Kane games. Dog. What? What? What do you mean? What do you mean? How many how many loops is this? Live die repeat. Shadow Man. Oh, you need a shadow man. I... My, my personal purgatory would be that. I'd be playing a game like this. I would just keep making the same mistake and dying at the same spot every time. Because I already do that. And it's like, how many times have I done this? I just failed the same jump over and over. And that's just eternity. All 
right? Yeah, it's literally just remember where those blocks are. And they're just right behind it. Hey, we got four. So we have enough to move on. Cool. Let's open this last door and then we'll uh, we'll call it a night. That way we can start next time at the new area. You know this this uh, playthrough of everything is making me play games that I probably would never get around to playing on my own. But I, you know, just missed out on at some point. Could have continued my life never knowing what Shadow Man was. I always just assumed it was like some weird, just straightforward action game. Uh, can't do this one, but I can do the one across the way. Please die. But yeah, I would, I would like the game more with a little more combat. A little more to the combat, I mean. I mean, I guess essentially like using, I still don't know what this does besides just an extra weapon. Having that is just like using my energy for missiles. Let's get on in here. Love these just low little bridges that are clearly just dead ends, but they fade out. And deeper still, the morbid mystery entwines. What love I ever had for life the screaming. to find its place in here. Locked within a cankered cell, beset by madmen, chained to hell. And deeper still, a vast, dark love I find within Asylum's darkly thrumming heart. No love of mine, not mine to love, for twisted is the purity of that finer thing, and I should lay my partly living down to free the world from terror's tyranny. All right, let's see. Is that oh is that like my flame arms that I have save adventure game saved we will uh, continue this next time 15 out of 120 pause that three hours and change how long was this game supposed to be again I feel confused unless it's really gonna pick up shadow man Oh, hold on. How long to beat is saying a little over 10. I think I just looked at a long play, and that's like 9. So it might take a little more than I thought. This game might actually be kind of beefy and have some, uh, some length to it. But I'm enjoying it now, so I'm not too against that. This might just be what we play this weekend. 
uh, we'll eventually finish it up and keep rolling. I, again, don't have anything specific planned, so I'm just going to keep playing N64 games for the foreseeable future, the next week or two. Um, yeah. I will let you guys know if anything else is coming up, but for now, I don't have anything planned, but keeping on, keeping on with N64. Hopefully, we can get some good stuff from the wheel, some quick stuff or good stuff. That's what I'm hoping for. Not that Shadow Man's bad, but I don't know. I'm just excited to spin the wheel again. But for now, that's going to be it for tonight. I hope you all have a good one. I appreciate you tuning in as always. And I'll see you guys next time. Have a good night. went surprisingly well. Ashley! Ashley! You okay? Yeah. Ow. If I... What do you mean? His name's Jumpman! He just jumped! I'm, I'm getting the hang of this now. I'm, I'm figuring it out. All right. Oh, I felt it. I felt it. Idiot. I can't believe. No! You're kidding me. Ah! What happens? No! Stop healing! Let's go! Yes! Ugh. Holy shit!